We are still following a developing story out of Milwaukee after police shot and killed a man armed with knives. We do want to warn you, you're about to see body camera footage from the shooting. You will see the police response, but you won't see the man getting shot. We are stopping the video just before the officers fired multiple rounds. Investigators say five police officers from Columbus, Ohio, pulled out their guns and shot Sam Sharp. Police say Sharp was armed and was lunging toward another man during an argument. Tonight we are hearing how the community is responding to this shooting 24 hours later. And that's where you find Jarrell Ballard, who is live in Milwaukee. He talked to another elected official who says Sharp might have acted in self-defense. What can you tell us, Jarrell? Yeah, hey, Brandon and Amber, you know, since that officer involved shooting, things here in Milwaukee have been fairly uneventful. That's according to Milwaukee Mayor Cavalier Johnson. But there are still a lot of questions regarding what led to 43 year old Sam Sharp being killed. Now, earlier today, I did stop by City Hall to speak with Alderman Bauman, who represents the district where that shooting happened. He tells me he was under the impression that police officers from outside the state were not going to be dealing with the public uh, outside the RNC perimeter. Now, Alderman Bauman tells me that he has been hearing reports that Mr. Sharp was also acting in self-defense when he pulled out the knives. Get reports from eyewitnesses at the location that the aggressor was actually the unarmed individual. That Mr. Sharp may have been defending himself from as opposed to being the aggressor. But again, we'll never know that for sure. Now, this district does have a large homeless population, but Alderman Bauman says Milwaukee police know a lot of the people who live in the tents and they also know how to defuse a situation. According to city officials, Mr. Sharp was experiencing homelessness, but he was also well known in the area. Now, in that body cam uh, footage that was released by Columbus police, it does show exactly 15 seconds from the moment they told him to put down the knife before five officers opened fired. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Jarrell Ballard, 27 News.